tried slide hammers, uh, sledge hammers, torches. Does the slide work? No. <laughs> <laughs> hey, it's nowhere near enough. Even in the press, it's like it goes up on that gauge pretty good, the pressure. Hi, my name is Jeff Rosa. I'm the president and founder of Promax Tool, and I want to take a couple minutes this morning to show you the new Tommy Tool, which is a wheel bearing puller that we've come up with to do Subaru and Ford right now, and we have other adapters for it to do many other engines, GM, uh, Cadillac, imports, BMW, Mercedes, just about everyone uses this kind of configuration today. I want to go through a quick overview of what the tool is. Uh, number one, we have it made um, with uh, two large uh, plates. What this does is bolt to the actual hub where the wheel mounts to. Um, we have a couple of bolts, uh, grade eight bolts that actually fasten it to the wheel hub. And then we have five set screws around the perimeter. And what that does is balance the load. And then the, mo the main pulling action comes from these three push rods. Uh, many tools on the market had the attempt to try to pull the bearing off at an angle. And when we looked at it, we thought it's best to put a triangular force against the back plate or the control arm or knuckle, which it's often called, and apply equal pressure on all three points in a triangular fashion to pull it off, precisely the way it's installed in the first place. Now we're just going to go ahead and bolt it up. And as you can see, it's very heavily corroded. And you can see the corrosion inside the hub. A lot of dirt, mud, and obviously aluminum corrosion through the stainless to the steel interaction, the steel interaction with the aluminum. And uh, this was a real, real bad example because it was a city of police, a Pittsburgh city of police uh, interceptor. It had been hit in the rear end and uh, this was one of the extremely difficult ones to get out, according to the customer. So there you have it. Any questions, feel free to call.